patchwork. You were blue before you were even born. We mark, we mark. Your mom cut into a two-story cake and out spilled blue and everyone hugged and pointed towards a cloudless blue sky because it was a sign. And here you are today, blue, dressed in blue, but tussum. But sometimes your paintbrush at school hovers above the pink. Some days so much hurt floods your eyes, you're scared to even blink. But tears are not pink or blue or weak. They're human. You are human. And when you grow up, the color you will come to love most is brown. You were put on this earth to dance. We know. We know. Ballet, tap, hip hop, your body bending to the beat, leaping from note to note. Dipping into demi plié, you dream in one, two, three, one, two, three. But those rhythms inside your head are also a kind of math. And one day you will discover coding and change the way the world moves. You go everywhere with a ball in your hands. We see, we see. You are basketball, baseball, football, any kind of ball, and you are born to compete. Even in defeat, the game feeds you. It leads you. But soon you will see your sport for what it really is, an expression. The sound of a bouncing ball is a language of your loneliness. You are bilingual, and one day, you will carry words with you instead. You will spin couplets on your finger because you've always been a poet. You are the kid perpetually in timeout. We sigh, we sigh. You shove and cut lines and talk over teachers. You tell jokes during the pledge and your whole body buzzes when you get a reaction. But the skill it takes to make people laugh is the skill you'll use to help people learn when you become a favorite teacher. And when a restless kid like you lands in the back of your class, you will see her. You will love her. You are kind to everyone and everything. We beam. We beam. When you win, it feels like a loss. The disappointment of another is a knot inside your stomach. You sit beside the new kid at lunch and give away your only cookie. But do not mistake kindness for a weakness. You are a powerful magnet, pulling people. Crowds will one day swarm to your ideas, and they will look to you for guidance, eager to follow. They will follow. You are more than a single note, played again and again. You are a symphony. You are sounds plucked from all the places you've been and all the people you've met and all the feelings you've felt. You are blues and pinks and loneliness and laughter. Mismatched scraps are accumulated over time and stitched together into a kind of patchwork. And even when your pattern loses its design, when it grows lopsided or tangles or is hard to follow, it will be beautiful. We are beautiful. You are more than a single note played again and again. You are a symphony.